Hi, my name's Ryan. I'm going to be your student physical therapist today. We're going to get you up and walk you with the parallel bars, but can I get your full name and date of birth? It's I'm sorry, 1-1-2011. Can I check that out through your Instagram? Yes, you're definitely I'm sorry. Uh, get the patient close to the start of the parallel bars from a seated position. Remove the legs from a wheelchair if necessary. Have the patient position themselves to the front portion of the seat. Both the patient's arms should be placed on the armrest of the chair. Have the patient lean forward in the chair and instruct them to push upward and forward with both their arms and their legs. Provide assistance as needed. Once the patient is standing, have them put both arms on the parallel bars for support. Guard the patient with the gait belt. It is recommended to stay inside the bars. There are different maneuvers and gait that can, the patient can practice within the parallel bars. Make sure to choose these based on the patient's abilities and needs. All right, so we're gonna do a two-point gait. So you're gonna alternate lifting one leg and one arm, opposite sides, and just walk down the bar. It is important to ensure proper fit when doing the parallel bars. Bars should be adjusted so the patient creates a 20 to 25 degree angle with their elbow bent while standing straight up. The bar should be grabbed about six inches in front of their hips. And the width of the bar should be adjusted to provide two to four inches of space between each of the patient's hips and bars. Parallel bars provide the maximum amount of support and require the least amount of coordination. Hi there. Oh, that's <laughs> your Instagram. Yes, you're definitely, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> <laughs>